What's up, everybody? For the Winatachi here, you know what it is. Thank you very much for tuning in to youtube.com slash for the Winatachi plays. It has been a while since we have done an unboxing video. We're here with another Razer unboxing video, and um, I'll probably do a review video in the near future. But for now, let's go ahead and get into the unboxing video of something that is going to drastically, I hope, uh, upgrade our streaming setup for YouTube, uh, Mixer, as well as Twitch and maybe any other platform we go ahead and join in the near future. If you have a platform that you want us to join, go ahead and post in the comment section down below and I'll go ahead and see how we can do that and fit it in. Um, but thank you all very much for tuning in. Again, like I said, it's been a while since I've done one of these, so I might be a little bit, uh, a little bit unorthodox when it comes to this unboxing, but it is going to be an unboxing video for the Siren Emote. Um, this is basically a microphone um, it is very, very similar to the rest of the sirens that Razer has, except it has an 8-bit uh, LED type of screen on it that you can that basically lights up emotes. Uh, you can go ahead and set it up in uh, a specific Razer app for it. Uh, once you just go ahead and plug and play, um, but you don't even have to set it up. Just plug and play and you're good to go. Uh, that's how easy this is to set up. And uh, I'm not too keen when it comes to setting up technology but I'm, I'm pretty decent at it. So hopefully we can get this bad boy working as soon as possible so we can get our streams up and running. And by the time you see this video, I'm probably already using it in our live streams. So come check us out. We live stream seven nights a week. That is Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. Yes, we live stream every single day of the week and we've been doing so for the past couple of years. So if you can, come check us out there. But without further ado, we're here to unbox this. So on the front, 8-bit, LED matrix. Uh, it's got the 8-bit emoticon LED display. It's got stream reactive emoticons uh, and hyper uh, cardioid uh, condenser microphone. Um, it's basically a razor. It's called the Razer Siren Emote. It's got a, it's a streaming microphone with emoticon display, as you can see right here in the front. It's got the little. Is it sticking out the tongue? Yeah, it's got the sticking out the tongue emoji. Um, on the sides, we've got uh, basically Razer on this side. Blank green, you got all of the warranties and um, what else you got? Oh, what's inside and all that type of stuff on the bottom. And then on this side, it's basically more about um, the 8-bit emoticon LED display, the stream reactive emoticons, the hypercardioid uh, condenser, the interchangeable gooseneck, plug and play and built in shock mount. And it goes a little bit more details on the back with a picture, which I'm gonna go ahead and go over a bit right now. Um, again, 8-bit emoticon LED display, which showcases hundreds of emoticons on your mic. Um, it's got a built-in shock mount. I'll probably get another one in the future. And um, I'll go ahead and make the display and the setup on my stream a little bit better. But it does got a built-in shock mount and it does work as I've been told. Uh, plug and play uh, for fuss-free streaming. So it's just simple setup, um, but you can go ahead and tweak up some of the settings. Uh, stream reactive emoticons, again, uh, ready for customization. There is an app that will that you can install once you plug and play. Uh, hypercardioid uh, condenser microphone for professional grade streaming um, with background noises and all that type of stuff. Again, you can go ahead and set that up with some of the buttons on the mic itself. Uh, interchangeable gooseneck for height extension, which I will probably need because um, I got to figure out how I'm going to get this microphone shown on the stream so you guys can see the emoticons being used but um, we're mainly here for the mic itself. So uh, it's also got technical specs as well as headphone amplifiers, um, the display uh, uh, RGB LED, as well as the approximate size and weight information all on the back. So without wasting any more time, we're gonna go ahead and check this one out for the first time. Let me go ahead and lift this cover. Ooh, okay. So this is one thing I love about Razer, which is kind of a, a selling thing uh, for them, is the way they display and the way they package their products is absolutely fantastic. And I'm not gonna just end it there. I've seen online some forum posts and whatnot, um, people having issues with their Razer products saying, oh, the Razer products are so bad because they just don't last long. Um, I've had my mouse for like six months. I've never once had an issue with any product yet with Razer. My, I have the, the Razer Megalodon team. I have a Razer Megalodon. Now I kind of broke it myself. It still works, but 
Um, I've taken the ear cuffs off of it and put them on my current one because that's how much that, that's how much more comfortable those ones were. But probably because I've overused them and they just fit me a little bit better. But the Razer Megalodon, they don't even sell that headset anymore, and it still works for me. I've had it over ten years. That's that's crazy. Um, my Razer Kraken did break, but I had it for six years, so it's like okay, got my usage out of it, got my money's worth. Uh, my Razer Nagas, my uh, I've had two of those. I've had products and they've lasted. If it lasts three years, I'm happy. That's pretty much it. Depends on the price. If it's a Razer Blade, then better be lasted. But without further ado, I have had no problem with Razer products, which is why I love Razer so much. And their customer service is absolutely phenomenal as well. So if you do have a problem, just go ahead and hit them up. This is not an advertisement. This is not, I'm not sponsored by Razer, but I am affiliated with them. Um, I like to go ahead and promote their products, and I just like doing unboxing videos. Uh, who knows, I might be able to get sponsored by Razer in the future. So, got the cable, the basic USB cable here. Uh, it plugs in the, uh, the mic into the PC, and it's threaded, and it's super sturdy and strong, uh, just like most of the cables. Actually, most of the cables are the same nowadays. They are uh, multi-threaded and uh, very, 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 very sturdy. Um, so that is the cable, the cable out. We're gonna go ahead and, okay. I thought this was the base, but this is just a piece of foam. This, oh, it's actually heavy too, which is nice. Nice to see. Um, this is most likely the base because it looks and resembles a base. So you're gonna put that there. Um, I'm not too sure how to um, put this all together. So we'll figure that out when we get the instructions, put that back in. Um, we got a little piece here that's probably going to be an attachment to the base as well as most likely this resembles the gooseneck. Uh, so we'll go ahead and put that somewhere. And of course, we've got the mic itself. And ooh, it's actually pretty light, which is nice. And it gives you like a little bit of an example of, a, of one of the emoticons being shown on the mic itself. Um, it's got a couple of buttons on this side of the mic, which is the back side. Um, so you probably be seeing that with the emoticons, or I could be seeing that with the emoticons, but it depends on how I get this set up. Uh, underneath, it's got, of course, the, uh, the USB plug-in. Uh, it's got an auxiliary plug-in. I'm assuming if that is correct, auxiliary plug-in on a mic usually means you can listen live to what you actually sound like from the mic, and that is very nice to going ahead and uh, setting yourself up. So hopefully that is the case. Um, I'm assuming there is more to this. Okay, here we go. And uh, that should be it. But just in case, I'm gonna go ahead and take this phone out. Okay, so that is it that is in the packaging. So I'm gonna go ahead and close this up really quickly, get it out of the way. And we're gonna go ahead and take a look at what we got here. Most likely the instruction booklet, as well as possibly some stickers, usually some stickers. Um, in here, we've got, it's time to get seen and be heard. Um, it's basically, ooh, that's actually a cool little print on the back side right there. But um, it's basically a little bit of a note uh, authenticating and certifying your Razer product. Um, and of course, you got the uh, Razer Siren emote booklet. And I've noticed, I was about to say, I've noticed there's no stickers, but we've got stickers. And I collect these things and I use them to make products that are non razor razor. So I've got a razor toaster, I've got a razor kettle, I've got razor um, external hard drives. Um, so yeah, I make non razor products razor. That's, that's, a, that's a good thing for razor to be sending me these stickers, team. But um, yeah, this is the instruction booklet, which I'll go ahead and read when I get home. Has all the information on how to set this up. But that's what comes in this little packaging. Um, again, it's very, very neat. Absolutely love it. I'm looking forward to finally getting my first, like, actual mic besides a headset mic. Um, when it comes to the headset mic, I'm mainly getting a mic for my, like, my, um, my, uh, my console gaming. Uh, when it comes to the headset mic, it's actually fine for PC gaming. But when I use console gaming, I get the, I get the, uh, the sound from my TV. So I usually just rest the headset on my uh, shoulders here and have the mic pointing up and it just does the sound quality. It's just, oh, it's so bad. But when I have the headset on normal and I'm playing a, a PC game, so I'm getting sound from my headset, it actually doesn't sound too bad. So hopefully this comes in use and this seems long. I might need to get an extension uh, to the USB, but it does seem decently long. I'll go ahead and find out. 
Um, it might be good enough, um, especially when it comes to my uh, console games. That's kind of where I need the length. Uh, when I'm on my PC, it's just, this is perfectly fine. Um, but yeah, thank you all very much for tuning in. Uh, stay tuned for some live streams with the Siren Emote. Um, I'll get this bad boy set up, and I'll catch you guys there. Subscribe if you're new. Please, please subscribe. We're almost at 3,000 subscribers. I'm dying to hit 10K. 3K is not even a thing anymore. We need to hit 3K. Let's go ahead and aim for 10K. Peace out. Have a wonderful day.